Welcome back to our channel, where we share the latest news and untold stories about Catherine, Princess of Wales, and her royal family. We've got some news for you today, heartbroken as William first breaks silence about Catherine's returning plan after her cancer, grapples. Despite our belief that the Princess Catherine rumours were over, the internet has once again begun to speculate about her whereabouts. Following her announcement of her cancer diagnosis in March 2024, Princess Catherine has been absent from her royal responsibilities due to her ongoing healthcare needs. The Irish Guards appointed her as colonel in 2023. Supporters are speculating if the Princess of Wales will be present for the 2024 Trooping the Colour Ceremony. Do not miss the very important announcement of Prince William in this particular video. Following a trip to Portsmouth on Wednesday, the Prince of Wales received questions about the well-being of his wife, the Princess of Wales. Prince William discussed his wife, the Princess of Wales, during a conversation with soldiers and their loved ones at a D-Day gathering in Portsmouth. On June 5, at a celebration marking the 80th anniversary of the D-Day landings, the Prince of Wales responded to a query about his spouse, who is now receiving medical care for illness. According to a report, a military veteran asked William about Catherine's health status. Prince William, who is 41, allegedly expressed that she would have greatly enjoyed being present. Since revealing on March 22 that she has cancer and is currently receiving chemotherapy, the 42-year-old Princess of Wales has kept a low profile. Kensington Palace announced the royal's scheduled operation on her abdomen in January, prompting the sending of the information. The Princess of Wales declared in a self-composed address that she would get back to her royal duties at an appropriate time, providing an update on her health. We kindly request your understanding that, as a family, we currently require a period of time, personal space and privacy as I undergo my medical care. Catherine, Princess of Wales, as expressed in the recorded video within the grounds of Windsor Castle, is in close proximity to her residence at Adelaide Cottage, where she resides alongside Prince William and their children, Prince George, Princess Charlotte, and Prince Louis. Engaging in my current position has consistently provided me with immense pleasure, and I eagerly anticipate returning to it once I have regained my health. However, at present, my primary objective is to concentrate on achieving a complete recuperation. Supporters are receiving encouraging news about Princess Catherine's ongoing struggle with cancer. Prince William said that the Princess of Wales has made significant progress in completing her cancer treatment. She has demonstrated a higher level of tolerance towards this preventive chemo. My wife and I had initial difficulties. William states that she is now taking strong medications, but she is exhibiting improved tolerance and overall progress. According to an observer who overheard Prince William conversing with a group of attendees, Princess Catherine has been seen in public recently. She is currently spending time with the kids. That is a rather encouraging indication. A specialist has pointed out that there is also good news from Catherine's husband, Prince William. At an upcoming ceremony honoring the 80th anniversary of D-Day, William replied to a veteran who inquired about Catherine's well-being. Indeed, Catherine expresses a strong desire to be present on this day, William said. I was informing everyone that her grandmother worked at Bletchley Park, therefore. She shared many similarities with some of the women here who also worked at Bletchley. In response to William's remarks, the royal expert stated that it seems reasonable to question him about Catherine. The expert expressed that when the royal family attends events without Catherine, her absence leaves a profound impact. According to the specialist, William's statement, together with stories of people seeing Catherine with her kids, Prince George, 10, Princess Charlotte, 9, and Prince Louis, 6 presents a very favourable portrayal. Someone questioned Prince William about Princess Catherine's participation in the Trooping the Colour on June 15 feet. Prince William stated that the woman's condition has improved and she expressed a desire to participate in the celebration. However, her ability to do so would depend on her physician's approval and her status at the time. Given this, the specialist asserts that Catherine will definitely resume her public responsibilities at some point. However, it is very unlikely that the Princess of Wales would be doing this prior to the Trooping the Colour Ceremony on June 15. The expert stated that she had demonstrated a strong desire to avoid public attention. She requires a certain amount of time to remain inconspicuous and focus on her recuperation. 
we had grown accustomed to seeing her on that balcony. The expert also thinks about it. The absence of her presence will likely create a distinct experience, prompting the question of whether we might have the opportunity to interact with the Wales children, namely Prince George, Princess Charlotte, and Prince Louis. They have ascended to that location on multiple occasions. They consistently exhibit impeccable behavior, frequently provide entertainment, and consistently seem to enjoy it. I wouldn't be surprised if William decides to accompany them, she continues. They may not be active members of the royal family currently, but we expect them to take on that role in the future. Prince George's status as a future monarch makes it very significant for the people to have the opportunity to see moments when George, Charlotte and Louis are present. Catherine is probable. A specialist assures us that we should not interpret or regard the lack of stroking the colour as an indication of future events. The princess is resolute in her determination to return to her duties, resume her previous responsibilities, and continue the admirable work she engaged in as the Princess of Wales, according to sources within the royal household and those close to her. This demonstrates the essential importance of her role in the monarchy. The monarchy is dependent on her, so it is imperative that she improve. According to specialists, it is necessary for her to have both time and space in order to achieve a comprehensive and thorough recovery. She and William are highly motivated by their work, and she is resolute in her determination to return. She is resolute in her desire, determination, and purpose to return to work. However, the journalist points out that throughout her original video statement revealing her condition, Kate explicitly said that she would be receiving treatment in an anonymous way. Following her diagnosis, we received information that she would not be providing frequent updates and would be taking a break from public attention. According to specialists, people find it difficult to adapt to the absence of the Princess of Wales on significant occasions. The public may require a period of adjustment to the absence of the Princess of Wales, but it makes sense for her to have a few months away from public attention. She is in dire need of this period to recuperate. She is undergoing an extremely arduous treatment that has significantly affected her. Despite her progress and improvement, she remains vulnerable to infection during this prophylactic chemotherapy. She will exercise caution over the individuals she interacts with. She will be unwilling to expose herself to any potential danger, she says. Hence, it is crucial for her complete recuperation that she remains away from public attention, maintains a low profile, avoids socializing, and primarily focuses on her immediate family. Thank you for seeing the video. Please provide us with your opinions and farewell for now.